Good day, lords and ladies, and welcome back to Wild Myth with me, Cornish Knight. Now, in the last episode, we'd taken care of this location. One of our party had been wounded and is repairing back up. So, let's get back into it, shall we? have got some areas that I want to explore, and we need to take care of this. We've got a while before the next incursion, so I'm going to do a quick lap. I'm going to go here, I'm going to scout this location, let's go. Wonder what we'll, when, I wonder when we'll stop. Journey after journey to battle after battle, hunger days and cold nights. Nothing but I expected something different, I guess. I mean, I did expect to be neck deep in ladies by now. So you're thinking, you know, Dana is kinda cute, I'd... Hmm? Won't lie to you. I think it ends when, decide it's, you, when you decide it's done. You'd be on one to cheer me up, Dane. Hold up, is that really a... If you need us, she's beautiful. Nice try, Dane, Diana, but I'm I'm no fool. And stares in disbelief. But she is beautiful, she's a, wa a waterling, a being born of the river and a wild steward who swims in its course and watches of its banks. Standing on the brink of the river, she stares to see Alan, Diane and Dane. Her gaze is dark and curious. Before, but before a winning words can be exchanged, she flees deeper, dropping something behind an article that she was washing in the river. Wait, don't go. I have to follow her. There's like a 75% chance whatever she dropped in the river is a mysterious treasure. She clearly wishes to be left alone. Let's grab the item, because that 50% chance is not great. Fern descends into the banks where the waterling stood. Peering towards, she points something divine dives beneath it. Really glad you're th that's not me. Fending, fending surfaces. But her arm. Come take a look at this guy. She reveals the unusual cat. A necklace. Excellent. Right, who do you want to give it to? Yeah, let's give it to her so her speed goes up. Right, so we've got this location. It's going to take us across a single legacy point to secure it. What do we want? Fabric. No, uh, do you want hide and fabric? Two fabrics or two hides? I'm gonna go up hides. Take us a little bit of time. Grabbed it. Go back here. We need to secure it. We're gonna do it quickly. We need to surface. Diane uncovers an alluring artifact. Ooh, opportunity. Sometimes Diane would dig a hobby that it was for a natural and genetic spirit. Contemplative, a contemplative, repetitive act. Fendel, I found something. So have I. Really? What did you find? A rooting pig woman. Hey, root up any glo gloom flower? The even stone healer sends folks out for it. Oh no, no gloom flower. Well then. Want to see what I dug up? Not really. It, it looks like, well, it looks like a tablet, a stone tablet. It's got a picture on it. Oh, be ca ca careful, let me hold it. Brush, brush. Hey, is that Fen Diana showing interest in my diggings? Well, you actually managed to find something this time. Looks like a map, right? You know some of these landmarks? Kind of had to find this place if you can. Right. We'll leave these to the secure site. Uh, actually... No, we'll go this. So we have two fighters. Uh, so it is going to be those two. Do you want a fighter range? Actually, I'm going to go that fighter, fighter, ranger, mage. Good combination. Man, we're really going somewhere. Okay. Story is triggered. Beasties. I don't smell anything. Whatever dug, this place must be dead, says Dane. Fedina. What do you think is down here, Fedina? Fedina. Perhaps nothing at all. I'm, in fact, that's very likely. And yet it doesn't feel likely. They glance around. You do kind of wonder, though, how many places like this echo beneath our feet? How many do we all have to walk over in a day? 
Oh, a dead end. They come to a round chamber deep beneath the earth. The torchlight reveals uneven ground, the old marks of tools in the hard dirt. Pardon me. Can you bring a shovel? Something must be down there. Something is. Robots! This place is dangerous. We should come back here with more people. Seems inactive. Let's dismantle thing first, but be methodical about it. You slash tendons, I'll jam it with some arrows. Alright, well, where do we start? Splinter crack. Actually, yeah, feel better. Look at look at all those alloy lining its chest plate. That's unusable. You hear a sound of an arrow. Cats are in the arm. Just get the thing. As more enemies pour out the darkness. We got ingots. And we got co Oh, I would like to... I would like to just quickly state something to everyone. Um, please remember that this game is still in early access, so... Stuff like the music and all that kind of stuff can... There's going to be more music added, I believe. Um, just various bits and pieces, so... As of now, it seems very simple. It's just that they're still doing a lot of work. Yeah. Got a torch. Not really interesting. Salvage it. If you um, need a break, if you need one. Venice stops by a near spring, wincing and pressing her wound with feeling that it contains. Sorry, Findina. You're apologising. Why? It wasn't so bad. Getting shot wasn't great. But other than that, really? So, so yeah. Why do you suddenly look so limp? Well, I was just wondering what we might have found if we'd kept digging. There could have been anything in there. <laughs> okay. Uh, they got those those bull moors. I hate those guys. Weird frog infected monsters. Okay, so they got that. Came back from a trip, which is nice, so she got a perk up. Passive, mayor damage deals bonus damage to all foes within range. That's good. Wisdom is really nice, actually. Brought, I'll grab Wisdom. Right, she'll grab that. They're fortifying this. Send those two up there. How long have we got until the next incursion? The site is complete. I think I deserve a break. Right, we've got 142 days and 80 days until that. Okay. Get there and do this. Let them regain. More salt. There's an altar of some sort of event. Our stars clamber high tonight. Oh, are those ours? Always clambering around our little stars. It's a good omen. You believe in omens, Dane? You start to spend enough time alone and you start having conversations with existence, omens, signs, fortune. Why can't they just be stars? Why does everything have to mean anything? You see a comet in the sky. The stars always tell their own story. Let's try John. Well, I suppose there's nothing we don't see. So many strange forces at work in the world. So little that we are perceived. The coolness falls over John a silence of a hundred winks. But glancing again where the comet party sees the spectrum of possible futures spell out its own trail. The trail dims. John rubs his palms together. I don't like to admit it, but I know things are connected in many ways. And we can sense. I count on it, really. Plus one to retirement age. And some spell thread. Okay, we've got a lot of monsters. And we've got an elemental. And he's got to be sprinting for it like no one's business. Okay. So let's infuse something first. What do we want to get? Yeah, let's start with that. Get rid of the raccoon. It 
dodged. That's not good. Get there. Kill it, please. Let's get behind cover. And we'll uh, try and shoot the frog. Can you get up? You can, but you, I doubt you're going to be able to interact with the creature this turn. You managed to get to it, though. You'd prefer to be left alone, wouldn't you? Replace with two on fire sword. I already have a fire sword. Let's get legacy points. Free, run free, spirit of the wild. So we got some nice amount of legacy points. Ah, excellent. Ooh, a lot of them. They got nourished, so it's buffed. Well, we'll have to do something about that. Let's see. Steel fire won't be great. Let's grab the stone table and we'll do infuse rain. That yeah, dodged. Calling blighter. Right. Let's get there and get his guardian on. You can get there. Or we can just shoot it right from here. Excellent. Turn guardian on. You can move up the support and we'll put an arrow into him as well. But he's got a lot of damage. Ah, uh, they bypassed me. Fuse. Still fire. Uh, take that and you can die in peace. I may take a bit of damage sucked. What's this? Uh, another speed medallion. I'll give it to the mage. Because it's, it's useful to have high... Your magic users do a lot of damage. Right. Uh, do I want to find an item or do I want to... So let's work quick. Because the longer we waste, the more likely next calamity happens. We can always make items. Ooh, tier 1 spear. Eh... That would be better. Is it one handed? Wasn't she carrying something? Um, no, let's give it to him. Then we'll go to here and scout. Let's go. I know there's a place down here we haven't fully explored, but I want to clear this place out. Ooh, they took root. That's not great. Okay. Um, well, let's just salt it quickly. Not that I care much, but shouldn't Dane be back by now? Maybe we've oversot some, or see did, should we backtrack? This peddler may know. Oh, oh, peddler woman, hmm? Excuse me, peddler woman, but wondering if you've seen a lady pass this way, armed and strong elbowed. Oh, firstly, I'm not selling anything. Could have been any time in the past couple of days. Small village, what are you, um, small village near what I used to call Dustbill Stacks. It's not Mr. Stacks, that's where she was headed. Give it a look, but... You never saw her? Sorry, no, but listen. The folks have there just been disappearing. I don't know what got into them. But it's not safe. I packed my things and headed out. Your friend, I hope, well, I hope you'll find her. The woman her cart roll away. Ominous woman, says Diana. Ima Im imagine picking up your life like that. Uh, is something wrong? Dane must have found out the hard way. Better get a look at going. Later, anything? 
No, you? No, it's a, it's a little village, but I have a doubt they have all packed up and left. Some gall amongst the rocks raises a brief gust of wind. Hear that? Come, great one. Okay, so we've got cult. Come, great one. Come, great one. Come, great one. Come, great one. Does this normally work for you? Says Dane. Yes, hus. Hus up, you. Says the cultist. Come, great one. We brought you a gift. Spare us. The urgent cries and ambient torches are easy to find in the est what otherwise still night. Dane's cage is a makeshift but sturdy. This is a sacrifice, isn't it? Not if we can stop it. Attempt to reason with them. Good neighbours, lands folk, listen, there's no need for blood. Rescue dinner by force. Reasoning with cultists is never a good idea, let's reason but let's scatter them by force. You should run, see that saddy husk person you locked up well. Oh sorry. You should run, see that sad husk person you locked up well, she's mine to deal with, not yours. No one step closer, the great one demands sacrifice, all our lives are at stake. Wrong, I think it's just yours. From within the cave a blue glow grows and a hungry growl echoes. Idiot, now it's too late, we can only hope it to sate itself on you. Or heroes, flanking attacks. This combat deal plus one damage. Let's say so they got cultists. So we're surrounded by cultists. We're down a party member. Okay, plus he's here. Great. And there's that. So let's infuse something, shall we? Let's infuse that. We do flare to blind people. So at least they're blinded. So they can't really see. Stab it. Now yeah, we managed to kill the creature. Excellent. Get here, and you can shoot him in the face. Well, that was the plan. He blocked it because he was blind. Shoot him. There's one cultist down. Right, let's find the rest of the party. Because our party member is deep in the midst of all of this, and I will not let her die. Okay. Infuse that. She's done. Let's get going. The two codes are probably in the back. If I'm a little rusty, folks, it's because I haven't played for about a week. So, some of my normal tactics may have forsaken me. Um, right, I hope everyone had a nice Christmas, by the way, or had a happy holiday, if you do not celebrate Christmas. Right, so. One cultist, two cultists. Sucks to be you. Infuse. Right, we got that. Hit the guy in the back. He dies relatively quickly. We get here. Stab. Down went the other cultist. Relatively straightforward and quick. Just the way I like it. Right, he leveled up. Active passive. Do repose for block, basically block or dodge. He leveled up. Uh, level one spear. Now salvage it. Uh, health would be nice. Give it to her. Give her a bit more health. The great one who was extinguished, reduced to ashes. The fools who fed it on the flesh of the innocents are paid with their lies. Day and the rest make a weary return from the cave in the gully. So how much did the others have to bribe you to rescue me? That's exactly the attitude that gets you into this kind of trouble. Because I'm always the problem, right? Down clams onto the distant hills as the young man approaches you. 
Let me first thank you, strangers. My name is Athwald. My parents were amongst the first sacrifices by that woman and her posse. This whole town was under their thumb. Now that they have gone, I think all of us are going to pick up and leave this cursed stone behind. I get it. Sometimes forgetting is the only way forward. You're welcome to take what you can't carry. Use it well, and remember that you've always have our gratitude, though I'm sure you won't recall our names and faces. We'll cherish yours. It turns out that to be a cold morning, clouds churn above the elder as the east devours the sun. Dane and the others head over out to scavenge some of the things that the villagers have left behind. The lair of the Great One will be overgrown with weeds and atrocities committed. There will be one day pass from memory. Bones of the band of buildings will long stand as testament to the danger of fear. The poisonous aspiration it breeds. Load of supplies. Right, let's capture this place quickly. How long will it take us? 24 days. Hopefully this won't be a mistake. Use like leave legacy points to get rid of it. Research is complete. Let's see what we found. We found some thread, which is always nice. We got buckled stun chants. Uh, okay. Twenty foot, nearly twenty-one percent chance to stun. Probably the next incursion is going to come from here. So we've got to rush down this way. Let's cancel it. We're rushing down this way to deal with it quickly once this is done. We can then do the main garden. If we're doing it fast enough. Because you can fail foil, fo fo so you can fail these mid chapter events and it can make the game really bad. Right, so let's assault. Normally I just use my legacy points, if I can, to stop the incursions. It's a better use of your points. They make for the cover of the trees, day dies, saddles far, saddles feather the trunks, though stories flicker in the mind. They say a hero used to belong to these lands, a towering woman who wore an antlered helmet wielding a blade of flashing gold. That, that was around here? Creaking borrowers speak to the breeze. Sincere Lycan, um, Sincere Lycan, she was called, and her soul was named Avenger, protector of the people, the, the godly beasts, trees. I used to aspire to her ideal, but, but, but that's... that's what? Oh, that's a sword. In the stories by, about the end of her life, it was said that she laid a sword to rest, not like a tool, but said it bid it a tired friend, but as you bid a tired friend to sleep. Grateful, she buried the battered, knocked blade, weird, weird, wired edge pressed into the earth that was made. Ooh, well, doesn't that make it ours since we found it? Careful, John. Cause, well, that's not friendly noise. God, the thing is, he's a spear wielder. Ah, oh, I got the wrong bloke, because if I give it to him, it's no use. Oh, I really want it, but it's not... I haven't set him up... To, I set him up to be a spear user. Mm. Draw the blade. Guard its resting place. Let's guard its resting place. The sword has earned its peace. I may regret this. I am really regretting this, because there's a ton of elite troops coming charging at us, and that's a lot of angry combat raccoons. Okay. Bone lance... Get him, Bone Lance. You failed me. Spectacularly, so. Alright, okay. Get here. Stab the evil, demonic, corrupted raccoon. Oh. Kufulu raccoon. Kufkun? Kufkun? I can't remember. Basically, the enemies that you fight in this are very much. See, if we swapped out her weapons, that would be better for her. Him, not so much. Silk step. See, because his setup. He doesn't have any other weapons besides that, you see. So. We know there's another raccoon lurking about. Okay. Good to know with him. 
that the other raccoon is the, the, the two final enemies are in this final room, which is nice. Because it means we can relocate nice and quickly. And yes, I know people have made comments about the music, but more music tracks would be added. You have to remember this is still as an early access. So, and there's a small team that are doing it, so their access to music or soundtracks is different. Well, not different, I mean limited. Man, aren't you ugly? And huge. Okay. Take that, yeah, ugly blighter. Uh, discus splinter blast. I like splinter blast because it allows you to to like render armor, which is something that, especially against some of these enemies, is really useful. Oh, it hit me. Oh, well, no, it's tongue attack. Okay, he needs to move out of the way. Shoot it, please. All right, dodge. That's not great. We'll fuse with Discus and try and hit him. He blocked. That's not great either. Okay. Yeah, please just chop it. Finally. Whew. Nasty things. Torch, not great. You are magnificent, love. You are right. I find it curious the way my blood jumps when I see you embroiled in combat. You, your torn, focused lips. Bind him a powerful radiance enveloped sword. Jingle, jostle. What the? The brilliance is blinding, sound is muffling, then. John is somewhere else. Oh. Not alone. You are strong, you and your friends. The woman appears solid, but mots of spectral dust waft from her skin, her armour. You are you are sin sinsar lichen. Yes, I was. Wasn't wasn't expecting such a beautiful of such a beauty, were you? You raise an eyebrow. I once carried the sword of Enzo until I was quite old. We fought and won together, but she never did like it, like to take a life, and I never did like to make her see. Oh yes, she was a spirit once, her home and mine burnt, and that it was we formed the pack to avenge our families or homes to fight long as we could. She became a legend, you both did. When my strength was gone, I returned to, to rest, here amongst these stones, but still. Still the lands need heroes, protectors, avengers. I am beyond this world now, but I'll keep watch to find those who might carry my mantle. She, she eagers to run beside you to grant you her strength if you'll have her. I don't know what that means, but I suppose it's if she's if she'll. A sudden flare sunders the fabric of this ethereal realm. John feels mist against his eyelids and that open eyed. The sword is nowhere to be seen. Her uh, John, what just happened? Hello, Avenger, says John. The abbot wiggles her damp nose vindictively. Radio. So these guys get even more dangerous now. Fantastic. We'll claim this place. A secure oddity. Jossel's oddity. Let's see if we can find a decent item for a change. And then we really need to book it. Because it'll take us time. We've got spell thread. Potency damage. Oh, bonus damage and potency. Hmm. Who would it be? I'm going to give it to her because if Fix is carrying around a magical. Her uh, greatsword does additional magical damage, I'm pretty sure. I, I, I do love this game, folks. So we're going to run back up here. It'll take us a bit. Of, oh, come on. No, this is bad. 
gather here. Let's go, sorry. Brain photos sometimes, folks. Okay, we haven't got long until the next incursion event, so we need to hop it. Come on, come on, come on. Because if too many of these happen, I have had the game basically says you failed the chapter and stuff happens. Okay, so here we are. What we're going to do now is we're going to put a cut in. I love this game a lot. The music is basic, I will say. I agree that there needs to be some more music tracks added. But besides that, I really like this game. For someone who loves D&D &D like me, this is like really enjoyable to play because it's basically a D&D &D campaign. Um, but if you have liked, please press the like button. If you wish to subscribe, please press the subscription button. You can follow me on Twitter, you can follow me on Steam, or you can even come in the comment section and I'll get back in contact with you. I'll see you all again next time, folks. Goodbye.